This is a sheep brain. It was once covered in the Dura Mater, which is a tough covering. The olfactory bulb, one, is located on the frontal lobe of the cerebral hemisphere and contains filaments of olfactory nerves. The second nerve is the optic nerve, which carries sensory impulses from the retina of the eye. Between the optic nerves is the optic chiasma and then the optic tract. This is the temporal lobe. Next is the infundibulum, which is located under the pituitary gland. It's the stalk of the pituitary gland. This is the mammillary body of the hypothalamus. This is the cerebral peduncle. These are fiber tracts connecting the cerebrum and the medulla oblongata. The third nerve is the oculomotor nerve. The fourth nerve is the trochlear nerves. These nerves are located at the junction of the midbrain and the pons. The oculomotor nerves and the trochlear nerves both provide motor fibers to extrinsic muscles of the eyeball. The pons and the medulla oblongata are both hindbrain structures composed primarily of ascending and descending fiber tracts. The fifth nerve is the trigeminal nerves. These nerves are involved in chewing and sensations of the head and the face. The sixth nerve is the abducens nerves. These nerves abduct the eye. This is the occipital lobe of the cerebral hemisphere. The pineal body is located here. This is the superior colliculi of the corpora quadrigemina. This is the inferior colliculi of the corpora quadrigemina. This is the cerebellum. This is the cerebral hemisphere. This is the frontal lobe of the cerebrum. This is the parietal lobe. And this is the cerebellum. This is the corpus callosum. This is the fornix. This is the intermediate mass of the thalamus. This is the cerebral peduncle. This is the pineal gland. These are the arbor vitae. This is the corpora quadrigemina. And this is the fourth ventricle.